I'm at 6233 South 23rd Street. Uh, this is in a very nice neighborhood. Uh, this is um, down in, I would say, I think it's Greenfield, uh, down by the airport. It's, we're only like probably about five minutes away from the airport. Um, the house is a little bit smaller. This house does not have a garage. Uh, let's see. We've got some scraping and painting, or we could wrap everything. The windows look pretty old, so I'm thinking that we're probably going to uh, wrap everything. So what we could possibly do here is probably take off the shutters, uh, maybe repaint it, all this yellow paint, a uh, different color, maybe um, you know a stronger color, maroon or something. Just make this pop a little bit more if we're going to try to keep the siding. Uh, the siding is a little roughed down, so maybe you know this is aluminum, so maybe we could paint the the aluminum siding um, if we're not going to replace it. And still, this would be a nice flip. I'm going to take a step back to show you the roof. This roof, uh, this house was built in 1959. The roof with it curling up in some sections, which is not bad, it's just right on the edge. We have two layers on the roof. We'll check out the back in a second, but if the roof is in pretty good shape, uh, it is that orange color, so we would try to have to match any color that's on the siding and on, you know, obviously the trim would have to match this color if we're not going to replace it. I don't see having to replace this. There's a couple areas that maybe just need a little touch up. As long as the back uh, yard looks fine or the, you know, the back of the house is good, I would say that you could keep this roof and we could try to put the money somewhere else in this house. Uh, obviously, uh, all, you know, tearing uh, this little water, uh, um, Kebab. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't want to waste my time on it. Tearing this out, uh, um, and then obviously putting some mulch, some uh, dirt down, uh, cleaning this front yard up, really uh, make this pop more too. The sidewalk as well as the driveway is in good shape, which is good. Um, so we have no concrete work as far as I know. For how high this these, the sidewalk is or the steps, we would have to put some railing on there. Grading away, grading away. Again, uh, siding and windows, new, new windows. If we don't do new siding, just paint the siding and paint the trim. I've seen people do that with flips. Uh, this is the next door. They've done already a remodel, beautiful. The roof is in good shape. I would say that don't touch that roof. Uh, it would ill sell. It's just some areas that just need to be cleaned up, pushed down the, the shingles. Uh, we do have an older AC, so that AC would definitely need to be replaced. Um, again, you can see the wear and tear of the siding, so just siding, windows, trim. Uh, the, gate, the fence back here is bowing. We'll be able to see it when I go around the other side, but we should, be, we should uh, take care of that. And we have a gas meter. Some overgrowth by the windows. Maybe we'll just uh, clean that up, of course, mulch it. New storm, new front door. Clean up the side of the house. Nice big yard. We have a little uh, shed that looks a little worn down. Um, it looks like that It'd have to be scrape painted, some siding that would have to be repaired. Nothing severe, it's a, it's a shed. So we just clean it up a little bit, make sure that uh, there's a little hole here. Let's just see how this side is looking. Yeah, the side is in just really bad shape, so uh, we could probably uh, repair the siding. Um, we could probably, because it's the base, we could probably just add um, a two by six or you know some sort of uh, pre-treated wood, put it at the bottom, clean this up, make it look nice. There's a lock on the shed. You can see the huge space here. Uh, the best part about this is that if you wanted to, you could add a one car, two car garage uh, in the, you know, in this area. And it wouldn't be hard at all because you have this space to work with. Um, Everything else is good. We have our electric service over there. Obviously some cleanup. The grading of this concrete was done well. It pours away from the house. It looks in great shape. 
Um, let's just turn around for a second and look at this neighborhood. Again, it's a wonderful neighborhood. I know this neighborhood very well. A lot of people here are mostly retired, uh, new families coming in, starting to build their lives here. And that's about it. Let's go check out inside.